Hi, YouTube friends. This is your girl, Cherie, coming to you with... It's not really a haul. I'm not really sure what this is. Yeah, I'm just going to show y'all two palettes. So, I have two new sleek palettes that I want to show you. Um, the first one is the I Divine Candy Collection palette. Now, I got this one on Loveocracy, and... Um, I only paid like $4.96 for it, yes, because I got a $10 credit for signing up. And so, yeah, this is what I got. It took me like two weeks to get it because it came from the UK. So, yeah. And then I have the iDivine Oh So Special palette, which is an alternative to the Naked 3 palette. So, it's this is not a dupe, but it's a great alternative. And I actually got... This on Instagram. Yeah, y'all know I be shopping and looking for stuff. So, yes. Yeah, so, um, yes, this is an alternative. And the reason why it's an alternative. So, if you are a person who's not really a big fan of the Naked 3 palette, but you like some of the pinks that were in that palette, then, yes, Oh So Special is what you need. So, matter of fact, let's get started with the Oh So Special palette. As you know, it is cute little sleek packaging. This is what it looks like. And if I'm not mistaken, it comes with 12 colors. Yes. 12 colors. Oh. Well, it comes with this little sponge applicator, which is really good for applying glitters if you are a glitter person. But these are just what the colors look like. Yes. And when I say it's an alternative, I'm trying to make sure you don't get blinded. Like, if I'm not mistaken, like this color right here, it's the same as like the Braveheart color and these colors right here as well. So as you can see, you, you have a lot of pinks in here and some burgundy looking colors. So this is a great alternative to the Naked 3 if you didn't want to get that palette because it has so many rose gold and rose colors in it. Like I for one didn't like the palette because it has so many pinks. I mean... I can only wear so many pinks. So I opted for this Oh So Special palette. And also another good alternative to the Naked 3 palette is the um, Lorac Unzip palette. Now this is the Lorac Unzip palette. Y'all, this is a beautiful palette. And when I say it's a dupe, not really a dupe. This is another great alternative to the Naked 3 palette. This is what it looks like. As you can see, you have pinks, browns, golds, rose golds. You have all of those colors in this palette. Personally, I love Lorac um, shadows better than I do Urban Decay. Yeah, I said it. Good alternative to Naked 3 as well as the Sleek um, Oh So Special palette. Now, this palette was $9.99. This palette is 40 bucks. So for 50 bucks, you can get, you can pretty much create your own Naked 3 palette and you'll still save $2. How about that? But I like these two palettes better than I do the Naked 3. Now, let's get back on track. Now, <laughs> the other um, sleek palette I want to show you is the I Divine Candy palette. And this is the one I paid like $4.90, so you're going to say $5 for This one is, if I'm not mistaken, is $11.99 on sleepmakeup.com. But I thought this palette was so pretty. Look at those colors. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> I'm over here dropping stuff. Let me see if I can cover up the mirror so it doesn't bond you. But look at that. Aren't those some pretty colors? Yes. Once again, it comes with 12 colors in the pack. And I got this one on loveocracy.com. And by signing up, they gave me a $10, um, I guess, referral credit. Because someone did refer me. So, yes, I got a $10 referral credit for signing up. So, I just used my $10 and I just purchased this palette. Like I said, it took two weeks to get to me because this one itself came from the UK. Now, this one, like I said, I got it on Instagram. So, this one, the person was already in the States. So, I got this one in like three days. So, yeah, I, I've been really liking Sleek Makeup lately. Um, as y'all know, it's a UK brand. And I have their, um, I have the bronzer. I also, I have the contour kit, but I gave it away. 
Now I want it back, so I'm probably going to buy another one since I gave that one away, but <clears throat> excuse me. But I really think these are some pretty cool palettes, and I really like them. Um, I'm not going to swatch these palettes right now. However, I'm going to put more information about these two palettes on my blog, which is shespokebeauty.blogspot.com. And on the blog, you're going to see swatches, and I'll go in more detail about these two palettes. And also what I'll probably do on the blog is create a look with these two palettes and that way you can see the color payoff because these are some very pigmented shadows anyway enough about that so yes if you didn't want to get the urban decay naked three because of too many pinks you have the oh so special palette from sleek and you have the unzip from Lorac. you can pick these two up if you just want to pick up a couple of um palettes from sleek you have eye divine eye candy and you have the oh so special these two i just showed you now i'm about to get Three more. I'm about to get the Garden of Eden, which is the latest one they've come out with. I'm going to get Sunset because those colors in that one is so pretty. And I think the third one I'm going to get is going to be um, Vintage Romance. That one came out last February and it is so, so pretty. So I'm going to get those three and then I'm going to come back and show them to you once they come in. But other than that, if you have any questions about these palettes... Leave your questions down below. Of course, I get back to you. For those who are wondering what lipstick I'm wearing, this is All Fired Up by MAC. And yes, this color is saying something. Y'all, actually, this is my Valentine's Day look. I was trying to figure out what I'm going to wear for Valentine's Day. So I just got in the mirror and started playing. And this is what I come up with. So I hope y'all like it. So I guess this could be also a face of the day video as well. Y'all, this video is just a combination of some of everything. So yeah, don't kill me. <laughs> just rock with me. Anyway... Other than that, if you have any other questions or concerns, please leave them down below. Give me the thumbs up, like the video, subscribe, share with your friends, family, whoever. As always, thank you so much for watching this video. Y'all have a great day. Thank you.